Good evening. Republican U.S. Senate candidate Marlon Stutzman is accused of misusing campaign funds. An investigation by the Associated Press uncovered Stutzman spent campaign funds on a family trip. And News Channel 15's Angelica Robinson is here to explain those allegations. Well, Heather and Brett, this whole ordeal revolves around the Stutzman's family vacation to California in August. According to the Associated Press, more than $2,000 was spent on airline tickets, car rental, and a hotel room. Federal Election Commission guidelines prohibit candidates from using campaign funds for personal expenses. According to the Associated Press, Stutzman wife posted pictures of the family's visit to the Ronald Reagan Presidential Library. It was captioned, Family Vacation. But documents obtained by the Associated Press show that Stutzman's Senate campaign spent $2,000 on the trip. A spokesman for Stutzman's campaign says the trip to California was for his campaign and all personal time was paid for out of Stutzman, Stutzman's pocket. The $2,000 that was taken from the campaign fund was later reimbursed. The article details hundreds of thousands of dollars that Stutzman's campaign has spent, over, has spent after he became congressman in 2010. According to the Associated Press, he spent roughly three times more than his opponent, Todd Young, who joined the House around the same time. Former Fort Wayne Mayor Paul Helmke says it doesn't match Stutzman's public image. That sort of high spending, fancy spending, uh, doesn't fit with the image that I know that Marlon's trying to project. It's a question of how does this fit with uh, the frugal, small town, uh, rural LaGrange County Marlon Stutzman image that, uh, that, that he's using in his ads. Now, we're going to continue to follow this story and we'll bring more information as it becomes available. Okay, thank you, Angelica.